Hey guys, CJ and RJ here with you. Uh, again, with hopefully another video, great video for you guys. The other day, me and my, and my parents and two siblings were walking along this road behind us here. Show the right there. This road here, we were walking along here. Where we, my dad just happened to look to the left, to his, to his, to, to, no way, to his right. And we stumbled upon this the walkway here. And we thought and we were all a bit, a bit suspicious, so we followed it and it leads us to some very well hidden tracks, which is what we're going to show you today. So without further ado, guys, let's do it. Let's go see where these tracks go. Let's do this. Let's, let's go. do it. <laughs> Oh, well, that's what's left of a possum. Or something. Yeah. Yes, possum, yes. God rest his soul. Or her soul. Because we thought it was someone's yarn. Until. Yeah. My dad. We were just turning back when my dad just happened to notice the opening right there. Talk about a hidden track, huh? And if because we, we wanted to get out of the sun, so we thought we would see where these go. And yeah. And that's the start of the track. Oh, beautiful down here. Look how shady it is. Whoa. Whoa, did you see that? There's a bird, yeah. There we go, guys. Welcome to the hidden tracks. I do love this track. Well done. I don't know how the hell. And straight through there, guys, is my mum's old high school fence. Oh. Little blackbird skimming on the ground. Yeah. Cool. And you got like a little bridge just here. Yeah. And it can get a bit soggy here, guys, so you always have to watch your step. Apparently, I've heard it can get a bit soggy. From the rain yesterday. Yeah. And. <laughs> but, well, we're not going to let the mozzies stop us from having our fun. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know too much. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Running. It's copying me, watch. I think it's a king cat. Red and brown. And then... There's three different ways you can go. Either that way, which I think will take you back towards the main road, but we can suss that out on the way back. On the way back, perfect. And then we go this way, which leads us to the other tracks that we went to. And then this is the one that will bring you out to that side street I was pointing out. And then when you get down here... And I'll just let my one of my friends know that I have a I have a new video that will be getting uploaded later today, and that's the one I'm filming right now for you guys. So not even my mum knew about this track because this track wasn't here back when she was a kid. Well, at least that she couldn't. Well, at least that she couldn't remember anyway. So that's why we, we thought we'd suss this out and see where the other two tracks take us. But if there's one thing you always watch out for when driving snakes, driving snakes, <laughs> I mean, out bushwalking on tracks like this, especially a very well hidden one, is snakes or anything that can be deadly, but mostly snakes. But because it's, it's hot and it's still very early, 
this, they, they wouldn't be ready to come out yet. As far as I know. And then as you guys can see, we've got some beautiful bushland on both sides. Dancer. Oh, we've got a little lizard that's just moving around down in there. We've walked along here, and that's when my brother picked up a stick. And my mum was fine until she held the hand that my brother had the little stick in. You didn't know about this track, did you, Rod? No, I did not. It's a very Little lizards moving around. <laughs> yeah, they do that a lot. They're getting sun off the track and then they run back into the bush. That's what they do. This is where we got to. Ooh. This track here is the one that we took. Okay. This is the other two I was telling you about. Oh, well, we've got this one here, and then we've got that one. I'm thinking, which one should we go to first? Oh, let's take the bridge. Yeah, all right, guys. So we're going to go take the bridge first, and then we'll come back and we'll do that one. Or maybe that this one here will somehow connect and we'll end up back up here somewhere. What, what? We'll find out. So let's do this. And as you guys can see, we've got some dragonfly. Mm. A few little webs here and there, but they won't bother us. Yeah. Oh. <sighs> oh, shit. Oh, crap. <laughs> oh, another lizard coming across. Tucking across in front of us. But if you ever see a snake or anything, guys, if you stay cool, calm, and collected, and just don't move, the snake won't attack, attack you. But if you show fear, that's what they feed off. They feed off your fear, and that's what causes them to attack. If you don't show fear, they'll be like, meh. Oh. Yeah. So we can't take, we won't take that one there, yeah. because as you guys can already tell, it leads to the school gate. To the school gate. <laughs> So where this one goes. So we'll go. Oh, hello, Mr. Skink. Oh, stinky. A stinky skinky. <laughs> <laughs> and I've been wanting to find something new for you guys for ages. And I think we finally found something different. A track we've never been to before. This is my very first time exploring these tracks for you guys. Because I've only been here in New South Wales for over 12 just over 12 months, almost 14 months. And I promise you guys this, I will be starting the train videos up again. I've just got to find some, I'll just be waiting until I go in the seal and I get settled properly. Then I can start, and then because I'll be in seal, I can start going, oh, hello, another skink. 
And when I go into Sill and I get settled in and all, all that, then I can start going to Sydney Central train station again and like filming XPTs and those sort of videos. And then I, Rod and I, or as I say, RJ and I, because we call ourselves CJ and RJ. Man, and that's RJ there. Sorry. And I'm CJ. Hi. <laughs> and yeah. And the thing I like about this one is that it's so peaceful. It's a very nice track. And I said to Dad, I'll go suss these tracks out and upload it to YouTube for all you guys to see the beautiful content that's surrounding us. You get all sorts of trees. And if you listen carefully, you can hear some crickets in the background. I love the sound of crickets, especially first thing in the morning. I think that used to be a track, but we're not going to take that for safety reasons. So, like a old tank of some sort, or something. MH. Uh, that, that's an MH, which usually means maintenance or something. Ooh. You guys can see different sort of stuff. And yeah, so me and RJ are going to start bringing some different content to the channel for you guys. We'll start, well, what we'll do is we'll look up some different tracks that are nearby. So from here, when we finish exploring these tracks, we'll go back to the car, look up another track, and we'll go, and if we've got time today, we might go explore another track for you guys. It depends on what time we get back to the car. And I think somehow... Maybe we might follow the fence. Down and around. Oh, yep, that's what it's for, yeah. Now, this, guys, is, is an old pipe water line. Mm. So, we'll go see where this goes, but and I'm not liking the look of this. Because if we get stuck here, it's going to be a bitch to get back out. Oh wow, it goes all the way up there. Mm. You might be able to walk all the way to the station. Oh, big butterfly. Did you see the size of that thing? Yeah. That was a big butterfly. An old latrine. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Be a good one if you have to be busting for a piss. Oh, there you go guys, you can hear the crickets better now. No, nope, they're not crickets, they're cicadas. A whole heap of cicadas. Now, this one here we're not going to take, because that leads up into someone's property. But, this one we can. Oh, because that one just leads up to the main road, as you guys can tell. Sorry guys. I just realised, just realised my camera was zoomed in. What the hell? That's better. I was just, I just happened to look at my screen and I noticed it seemed a bit blurry. So, sorry about that guys. It will seem a bit blurry at first. But it gets clearer towards the end of it. Oh, that's a bit sus. Who would just dump a pram there? Mm. Ain't that a bit suspicious? Well, yeah. Ah, it's broken anyway. And this way we come to the end of the track. I think we can go across. And we are now back. I think this could be Lynhurst. I can't, I'm not too sure. I 
So now we know. We'll see. Yep, that's Lenhurst Drive. Because there's the side street that we took. Crossing the road. I don't know if that's another track, but we're going to suss it out. If it is, then why not just continue the video and just see whether it is too. It's another track. Well, let's go see where it goes. Yeah. And it's, as you guys can see, you've got beautiful blue skies, which is a better, which means it's the perfect day. And it's not too hot and it's not too cold, it's just right, the temperature. And that is what makes it the perfect time and the perfect day for a nice little bush walk. Oh my god. That's better. You got RJ in front of us. Uh, I think that's where that track ends. That we will. And if it does, we can just go back to, towards the car and look uh, up in the car for some more tracks to, to explore. Yeah, 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 that's the end of the track. You sure? I think it's going. Kind of... Yeah, I think it might as well. There's a carrot up there. There's a what? Carrot up in the tree. No, they could... Oh, they are too. There's a baby one making a the noise. There's a king carrot. Remember I said that whistle? But I think there's a bit too many mozzies here though. Oi. Someone's listening to Elvis. Mm, Elvis yeah. That's a Whoa, there. shit. That's the mum. Where the males have the red head. So that's a girl. So the difference between what bird? So what's the name of that bird again? So the difference, you can tell the difference between a king parrot, whether it's a female or a male. A male has a green body with a red head, but the females have a green head and the bottom part of the body is all red, but the top part's all green. Yeah, I think... Oh, hello. Oh, that looks a bit... bit oh, no, nah, we won't take that one because we don't know where that goes. There's a crossing. Where? It is a crossing. But looks very slippery. All right, we can stay, keep going down here. So we'll suss this bit out, but if it comes to another dead end, we'll turn around, head back to the car, and we'll go find another trail to explore for you guys today, which is our goal. To explore two different tracks today, which is what I really want to do. Yeah, I don't know if that if that if that's a good idea going down there. Oh, we'll keep going until we can go no further. That's a good idea. Did you never know? Because I got a feeling it'll keep linking up. Big tree ferns going. Yeah, big tree ferns here. Another drainage pipe. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> Whatever the fuck that is. Thanks, The nuts. That's a nut? Yeah, a bunch of nuts. That was weird. And the grass down there? A rat trap. Ah, so that's a rat trap. Yeah. Well, there you guys. Go, guys. You've just seen your first rat trap. 
caught on camera. So that one leads up to the house. Oh, up and around. Where around. this one looks like another track. But if it goes no further from here, we'll turn around. Yeah, it comes to a dead end there. Look. Maybe. Rub the walk and walk and walk I just want to be careful. Oh, wow. You don't see blue flowers that often. Yeah. 